ਉਹੀ ਕਾਰ ਵਿੱਚ ਚਾਰਜ Q ਮੂਵਸ ਔਨ ਅ ਫ੍ਰਿਕਸ਼ਨਲੈਸ ਹੋਰੀਜ਼ੋਨਟਲ ਪਲੇਨ ਸਰਫੇਸ ਅੰਡਰ ਦ ਇਨਫਲੂਐਂਸ ਆਫ ਅ ਯੂਨੀਫਾਰਮ ਇਲੈਕਟ੍ਰਿਕ ਫੀਲਡ E ਓਕੇ ਸੋ ਲੈਟ ਅਸ ਅਜ਼ਿਊਮ ਥਿਸ ਇਜ਼ ਦ ਯੂਨੀਫਾਰਮ ਇਲੈਕਟ੍ਰਿਕ ਫੀਲਡ ਐਂਡ ਥਿਸ ਯੂਨੀਫਾਰਮ ਇਲੈਕਟ੍ਰਿਕ ਫੀਲਡ ਇਫ ਆਈ ਪਲੇਸ ਅ ਟੋਇ ਕਾਰ ਹੈਵਿੰਗ ਚਾਰਜ ਹੈਵਿੰਗ ਪੋਜ਼ਿਟਿਵ ਚਾਰਜ ਥੈਨ ਇਟ ਵਿਲ ਸਟਾਰਟਸ ਮੂਵਿੰਗ ਡਿਊ ਟੂ ਦ ਇਲੈਕਟ੍ਰੋਸਟੈਟਿਕ ਫੋਰਸ ਇਨ ਦ ਡਾਇਰੈਕਸ਼ਨ ਆਫ ਇਲੈਕਟ੍ਰਿਕ ਫੀਲਡ ਨਾਉ ਇਨ ਦ ਕੁਐਸਚਨ ਇਜ਼ ਗਿਵਨ ਥੈਟ ਡਿਊ ਟੂ ਦ ਫੋਰਸ Q E ਇਟਸ ਵੈਲੋਸਿਟੀ ਇਨਕਰੀਜ਼ਸ ਫ੍ਰਮ 0 ਟੂ 6 ਮੀਟਰ ਪਰ ਸੈਕਿੰਡ ਇਨ 1 ਸੈਕਿੰਡ ਸੋ ਹਾਊ ਮਚ ਐਕਸਲਰੇਸ਼ਨ ਇਜ਼ ਪ੍ਰੋਡਿਊਸਡ ਸੋ ਐਕਸਲਰੇਸ਼ਨ ਇਜ਼ ਇਕਵਲਸ ਟੂ A ਇਜ਼ ਇਕਵਲਸ ਟੂ V minus U upon T ਸੋ ਹੀਅਰ V minus U upon T ਸੋ ਇਟ ਇਜ਼ 6 ਮੀਟਰ ਪਰ ਸੈਕਿੰਡ ਸਕੁਐਰ ਰਾਈਟ ਐਟ ਐਟ ਥੈਟ ਇਨਸਟੈਂਟ ਦ ਡਾਇਰੈਕਸ਼ਨ ਆਫ ਦ ਫੀਲਡ ਇਜ਼ ਰਿਵਰਸ ਸੋ ਇਨ ਥੈਟ 1 ਸੈਕਿੰਡ in the direction of the field is reverse so when the uh, car is moving in this direction because of the direction of electric field when you reverse the direction of electric field what will happen the car will not stop suddenly but its velocity is 6 meter per second right so first its velocity will be zero and then it will reaccelerate in the opposite direction okay so first it will not stop at the moment it will move ahead its velocity see first its velocity increases from 0 to 6 okay now it will decrease from 6 to 0 and then again it will return right so at the instant when the direction of the field is reversed the car continues to move for two more seconds right so uh, the average velocity and the average speed of the toy car between 0 to 3 seconds are respectively see the question is very easy but just we have to understood few things right our concept of uniformly accelerated motion should be uh, very clear in that case we can understand this easily see as the car is accelerating right so it acquires 0 to 6 meter per second in one second now the direction of the field is reverse it means the same force will act on the charge but this time the force will act on the reverse direction okay so what will happen so it has acquired 0 to 6 meter per second in one second right again from 6 to 0 it will take same time right so for 2 second it is moving in the forward direction now again for the next one second it will acquire 0 to 6 meter per second in the reverse direction okay so the same thing is given so initial velocity is 0 it acquires 6 meter per second in one second then the direction of the electric field changes right so in another one second its velocity becomes 0 and on the th in third second its velocity changes back to 6 meter per second but in the reverse direction okay so uh, for the first second for the 0 to 1 second how much distance it has covered so from the second equation of motion we know that y is equals to half at square so it is half a acceleration is already we have obtained 6 meter per uh, second square okay so half at square and time is 1 second right because we are calculating for this part of the journey so it has covered 3 meter so again for this part it will cover 3 meter and again for this part it will cover 3 meters so all calculation are shown here okay so the total distance travel so the total distance travel is 3 plus 3 plus 3 9 meter so the total distance travel is 9 meter and the total time taken is 3 second so the average speed is 3 meter per second so we have two options in which average speed is 3 meter per second now what is the average velocity velocity is the displacement upon time so what is the displacement so 3 plus 3 6 then again it is coming back so minus 3 so the displacement is only 3 meters because displacement is the distance between the initial and the final position so the displacement is 3 meters so the average velocity is displacement by time so it is 3 by 3 that is 1 meter per second so option b is correct